फ्रेंड वेलकम टू माई YouTube चैनल इलेक्ट्रिकल बुस्ट टूडे वी लर्न कीच ऑफ वोल्टेज लॉ कीच ऑफ वोल्टेज लॉ द कीच ऑफ वोल्टेज लॉ से अदर नेम इज कीच ऑफ वोल्टेज लॉ इज वी कैन कॉल दैट कीच ऑफ ऑल्सो वी कॉल कीच ऑफ Kirchhoff's second law, second law, or Kirchhoff's Kirchhoff's loop rule. Okay, that's it. This law states that this law states that the algebraic algebraic sum of sum of वोल्टेज इन ए क्लोज सर्किट इज इक्वल टू जीरो दिस लॉस्ट एट दैट दिस लॉस्ट एट दैट द एल्जेब्रिक सम ऑफ वोल्टेज इन ए क्लोज सर्किट इज इक्वल टू जीरो हियर Uh, we previously know what is the algebraic sum. Here we know what do you mean by closed circuit. This law states that in a closed circuit, the all voltage is equal to zero. The summation of all voltage is equal to zero. Let first we understand what is what do you mean by closed circuit. If If a current is start start from positive terminal and and go to the different element, then again come to that terminal. It's called closed path. Here, here we take the source is B, and this is a load or R one, and this is R two. Here some voltage drop. This is called V one. And this is your some voltage drop. This is called V two. Okay. okay, here we have like KVL. Okay, ah, uh, let here the we apply a KVL. First, I assume a a current direction I. Okay, here we the current is flowing through them. This is take plus and minus. This is plus minus. Okay. Le if let's start the algebraic sum of the voltage in a closed type is equal to zero. Let we take negative two. We assume we assume assume negative two positive is negative. And positive to negative is positive. You can also assume in reverse method. Okay, let us apply. Here negative to positive. Here B is all negative to positive. So B is negative. Then plus B one. Then Plus B two is equal to zero. Minus B one plus B one plus B two equal to zero. Or KVL can also say can also say the algebraic sum the algebraic sum. Of source voltage, 
सोर्स वोल्टेज इज इक्वल टू इज इक्वल टू एलजेब्रिक सम ऑफ वोल्टेज ड्रॉप इन ए क्लोज सर्किट हियर दिस भी इज द सोर्स वोल्टेज एंड दिस भी वन एंड भी टू आर ड्रॉप सो वी कैन ऑल्सो से वी इक्वल टू वी वन प्लस वी टू इक्वल टू the necessity of kvl uh, where to find some current in a closed circuit okay. uh, kvl also used in in our mesh analysis or more higher level of circuit analysis let take a example let take a take an example sorry so where you can better understand okay let's take a example let here a circuit like that uh this is uh, this is we take here more completed circuit Here, let this is ten volt. This is let three ohm. This is five volt. This is six ohm. Okay. Ah, uh, first we put the polarity of the elements. Okay. Ah, uh, well, here the current is let take it clockwise. So the polarity it is plus. Minus, then it's plus minus. Okay, this ten volt and five volt are source. Okay, uh, then the current I is flowing through them. Then we apply KV. Let this is B one, this is B two. Okay, let apply KVL in it. Okay, let take this is minus two plus, then it is minus ten. Sorry, apply KVL. KVL. Okay. This is minus ten to minus ten. Then this is plus B one. Then this is minus five. Then this is plus B two is equal to zero. Or we can say ten uh, plus five equal to B one plus B two. Here we to find V one plus V two. Also, we can say V one equal to three into I one. Let's say I and V two also called six into I. Okay, let's put here ten plus five is equal to is equal to how much? Three i plus six i, okay. Three i plus six i, okay. Then fifteen equal to fifteen equal to nine i nine i. Then i equal to how much? Fifteen by nine ampere c. Here, how can we find a current in a closed circuit using KVL? In our next video, we are going to learn some more difficult level of problem using KVL and KCL and some other method. Please join with us, with us, and support with support us. Okay. Thank you for watching this video. Please like and subscribe my video. for more update thank you